one would hope that, and I do believe that sort of things are in place in terms of our supply chain to support patients on their therapies. You know, and the advice and the information being given by NHS England and the Department of Health is that nothing really should change. That certainly people should not be stockpiling medicines, we should not be hoarding medicines, and that we should just work with our suppliers, work with our wholesalers, and work with pharma to ensure that we have medicines for our patients. But as I said, it's very hard to predict the future. When we have sort of, there are always sometimes shortages of medicines out with of things like Brexit. And that's partly just a function of global pharma and the way sort of, you know, medicines are manufactured and supplied across the world.